there guys, it's RandomAc5 and in today's video I'll be going over the latest snapshot by Jeb and John. So many minor bug fixes and tweaks. Creepers no longer explode after death. I never experienced that bug myself but I guess it happened. Villagers can no longer open iron doors, that was a bug in the previous release. Cats, ocelots, zombies, wolves and skeletons no longer spin on half blocks. So let me test it here. When they're on this block, they would used to spin around like crazy. And I've noticed another bug. They don't really want to follow you when they're on half steps. They kind of just stop and just stay there. That's really weird. So that's another bug they have to fix, I guess, in the next release. Cobwebs will prevent the player from receiving full damage. I really like this one. Uh, not options. And yeah, too many items has been updated for the latest snapshot, so go have some fun. So let me just fast forward this until I hit the ground. And there, I didn't hit the ground. So that's one thing I really like about cobwebs now, is that you don't get damage when you hit the ground. Doors have been changed to properly detect if they are open or closed. Double doors in existing maps will need to be updated. So this is going to make a lot of Minecrafters happy. So one pressure plate opens that door, and this one opens this door now. You don't have to invert the signal, and you can now make double doors without any confusing wire. And yeah, you have to step on both of the pressure plates, if you just step on one, only one door will open. And then, same thing with double doors, I mean, iron doors, one will open, both will open. Alright, villagers now socialise with each other, and other mobs. So as you can see here, these two are looking at each other, it looks like they're having a staring contest, but they're actually, you know, meant to look like they're talking to each other. And this one will just look at the pig sometimes, and that's, I guess, socialising with mobs. Sometimes the pig will look at him back. And yet, there you go, they're talking again. Oh, there you go. Alright, on to the next thing. Villagers go inside for shelter when it's raining. So now let me turn it... No, let me turn rain on. And let me spawn a villager. There he goes, he goes into the house. Do you like it in here? I bet you do. Ah, oh, I keep pressing escape instead of... Instead of E. Alright, so now I might as well put myself on back to creative. Not rain, creative. Get myself a villager one again. Alright, on to the next thing. When player is targeted by a hostile mob, it will continue to track the player despite being attacked by other mobs. So yeah, that one's really just a common bug fix. Zombies AI have been improved on hard difficulty and hardcore mode zombie breakdown doors. Now let me turn it back on to night. Turn the brightness all the way up. And spawn a zombie. Can you hear that? He is trying to break through the door. I'm not sure if he's going to try and continue to break through the door. Let me hit him. That, there you go, he broke down the door. So that's one good thing, you actually get the door back. So that only happens on hardcore and hard mode. Zombies chase and attack villagers. So let me put it back onto... I was in the right place anyway. Onto normal, and get a zombie. Now attack the villager. And villagers run away as well. Oh no, no, snow golems are gone. So yeah, that's just one very funny thing that I felt that was funny. Alright, on to the next thing. I want these eggs. Did I just... Did I just duplicate those? Oh well. Alright. Added new sounds. Cats meow, cry, howl, purr and hiss. Oh, not break the block. Let me turn it up. Can you hear that? 
There's only one sound I can really show you at, at the moment. Let me get two ocelots, see if they fight with each other. Yeah, I don't know. But anyway, they make other sounds. So that's really all I can show you at the moment is those sounds. Better movement for mobs in water. Most mobs move slower. Cave spiders swim extremely fast with the water stream towards player, but seem to be almost not moving against water streams. That's pretty cool. Zombie pigmen swim faster in water. Added rare item drops for mobs. Zombies have a rare chance of dropping iron ingots, helmets, shovels, and swords. I think that's a bit overpowered, because if you have a mob trap, you can get quite a lot of that. Skeletons have a rare chance to drop a bow or enchanted bows. That's kind of overpowered too. A zombie pigmen have a rare chance to drop a golden helmet, golden ingot, golden sword, and an enchanted golden sword. I think they're all too overpowered, because you can get them quite a lot. Alright, on to the next thing. Pressing F1 to hide the HUD additionally disables the hitbox outlines on blocks. So as you can see, there's no... Uh, there's no outline. In place blocks, destroy them. In press buttons, levers, destroy torches, destroy fences, um, signs. You can still do all the same things. Now let me just get some snow blocks. Alright, on to the next thing. Monster spawners now show correct mobs in multiplayer. That one is a real must, because I really like that, because you'll find a pig spawner, even though it's actually like a skeleton or a spider spawner. Snow golems now take damage from rain and water. Turn rain on. And look, he's taking damage. Oh, he's instantly dead a bit too fast they say but I guess that's a pretty cool addition because it works as real zombies all right so notable bugs wolf AI can completely break causing them to freeze you can still tame them and make them sit but they do not follow or teleport to player wolves won't always follow the player after being tamed wolves teleport and attack mobs when the player is hit even if the wolves are sitting or far away after that they follow the player normally. Some wolves may not attack, but teleport to the player and remain sitting. Zombies break down iron doors on hard difficulty. So let me replace this door with an iron, and let's see if that bug exists. Iron door, iron door. I keep going past it. Oh, iron door. None. Hard. Midnight. Let's get a zombie. So I don't see him attacking the door. I guess it's a random chance of him attacking the door. There we go. You can actually hear him trying to break down an iron door. And there we go, he broke down a iron door. That should be fixed in the next release, so... Yay. I guess that bug will be fixed. In Canadian English language file, there are some items A after it. Ex example, Diamond Boots A. I guess some idiot did that. <laughs> in single player mode, some seeds will pop off if planted next to each other. So yeah, that was just a random bug that might happen sometimes, so yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this snapshot video. I did too. It was fun to make, I guess. So please like, comment, and subscribe, and enjoy.